Hi everyone, tonight I'm making patty pan squash. They're also called scallop squash. You can see the scalloped edges. I buy these at my local farm stand. You can find them at farmers markets as well. They don't sell these around here at the food store. They are a bright yellow. Sometimes you'll see some green in them. And they'll be small. And this is about the biggest I've ever seen them. These are really easy to cook. I'm going to be sauteing them. The patty pan squash can also be boiled, steamed, oven roasted, fried, or cooked in the air fryer. So like I said, tonight I'm going to saute them in a skillet. First, I wash them off and I'm going to towel dry them. Cut off the stem and the other end. I cut the squash into wedges. You can cut them into any size of your choice. I'm going to continue cutting up the rest of the patty pans. I'm using a non-stick skillet. Melting some butter. Add some extra virgin olive oil. Heat that up. I'm going to add some minced garlic. Let this cook for about one minute. You can also add onion or peppers and mushrooms. Because of what I'm making for dinner tonight, I don't want to have too much extra flavor in with the squash. Now add the patty pans. Toss this around and I want to continue sauteing. Salt and pepper to taste. Now I'm going to add just a little bit of Italian seasoning. Just keeping it, like I said, very simple and basic. Oh, I can hear a crow out there. He's quite vocal. Hello, crow. So just keep tossing this around. I'm sauteing on a medium high heat. I like to cook it so it gets some caramelization. It usually takes about 15 minutes for it to saute. You want to cook it until the desired firmness. I like mine a little bit firmer, but some people like them softer. The patty pans are done. I just use a fork to poke into it to make sure it's to the desired texture that I like. I will also be serving this with some Parmesan cheese. Thanks for watching guys. I'll leave a link down below to my blog. Have a great day.